Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Entering statement charges is the first step in preparing billing statements that you can then send to customers. This can be a more effective way to collect customer charges over a period of time for certain types of businesses that do not need to send out an invoice for each charge assessed to a customer. With statement charges, you simply enter the charges directly into each customer's accounts receivable register as they are accrued. Later on, at the end of the billing cycle, you can then send the customer a statement that lists all charges that are due or past due. You can access the customer's accounts receivable register by opening either the customer job list in QuickBooks 2003 through 2005 or the Customers and Jobs tab within the Customer Center if using QuickBooks 2006 through 2011. You can select the customer to whom you want to assess statement charges and then select Customers from the menu bar and choose the Enter Statement Charges command. This will display that customer's accounts receivable register. To make an entry into the register, just enter the date, the item, the quantity, and the accounts receivable account under which you want to place this charge in the next available entry within the register. When you're finished, simply click the record button to record the statement charge. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.